Hello, um, welcome to a, a special Let's Play of, uh, Spec Ops The Line. Sorry, I just had a rough day. Um, let's get right down to it. Campaign. New game. Let's replace the crap because I just wanted to test out settings. I will be doing it on Combat Op, which is normal difficulty. Let's do it. Yeah, I like how it just throws you right in the midst of the action. Now, as few know, I already have this game on uh, Steam. <laughs> but the Steam version doesn't like my computer for some odd reason. Got him. No, 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 no. Oh, you. Hi. Yeah. Do, 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 do. Non stop fire action. Hello? More? Why? How did they get all these helicopters here? Eh, eh. Take this guy out. Yeah. Did I get him? I didn't even get him. Now I got him. Keep it sturdy. Eh, 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 eh. Yeah. Eh, eh. Ooh. Whoa. Whoa. It went flying. Uh Oh no 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 And that's just the opening. It's not legit. But yeah, the Steam version was pissy with my graphics card. No matter what graphics card I seem to throw into my system, it doesn't like it. John Conrad, the greatest man I ever served with. Well, I don't know. There was this one time in Kabul when he dragged my bleeding carcass half a mile to an evac chopper. So maybe I'm biased. But the facts don't lie. The man's a fucking hero. Remember when the first storms hit Dubai? You're probably all safe and sound at home watching TV. Well, Conrad was leading the damn 33rd out of Afghanistan. Instead of coming home, he volunteered his entire battalion to help with the evac. Bet all you did was send a check. Rumor is Conrad was ordered to abandon the city. He defied that order, and the 33rd stood with him. Now, the official story is still hazy, but what happened next? All we know for sure is that the storms got worse. Much worse. Last thing we heard out of Dubai was that Conrad was leading a caravan of survivors out of the city. That was six months ago. Then, two weeks ago, we picked up this transmission. Colonel John Conrad, United States Army. Has been evacuation of Dubai.
And then through the desert we go. Um, but yeah, I picked this game up. Yeah. Captain Walker. What is it, Luga? Got a situation, sir. Mission critical? No, sir. Then take it up the chain, Sergeant. Roger that. Lieutenant Adams. I hear you, Sergeant. What's your status? Status is chafed, sir. You say chafed, Sergeant? Yes, sir. A local airborne insurgency has infiltrated the U.S. zone designated as my pants. Sir. <laughs> Shut up, jackass. Gentlemen, welcome to Dubai. Yep. It's still dead. Yet to be seen, Sergeant. You got a lock on that transmission? Yes, sir. About 800 yards away. And we're 800 yards away from seeing who's more full of shit. You or Intel. Wow. If I wasn't a hardened killing machine, I might have hurt. Lugo's my favorite. Special guest me. Yay. 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 Alright, remember this place has been designated a no man's land. Which means we're not um, supposed to be here. There we go. Roger, Dodger. Roger, Dodger. Okay, grab some cover. No, I don't want to see no cover. Bye. Nope. Welcome to Dubai, ladies and gentlemen. What happens in Dubai stays in Dubai. Oh, wait. Come on, let's just find a way down. You got it. Got it. There we. No, 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 no. <laughs> you okay? You, you okay? This is what's left of the damn 33rd. Yeah. Command thinks otherwise, or we wouldn't be here. Yeah. Hey, got some rope over here. Let's put it to use. Whee! That's enough, Lugo. We're just keeping it light, boss. Yeah, I don't need light. I need you focused on the mission. What mission? We're basically poking a dead dog with a stick. We have our orders. Locate survivors. The city immediately. Radio command from outside the storm wall. Send in the cavalry. Go home. There's cavalry. Hey, did you guys hear that? Fucking what up? I am hurt that you'd even ask. Ain't nobody here, man. Sounds like the transmission. Huh? I could have sworn I heard somebody. Come on, let's just get this over with. Yes, I know the controls already. <laughs> Anyone out there? No. Says what? Leave it alone. No one's out there. And what the fuck are we doing here? Uh -huh. Lugo's got a point. Are you taking his side now? Back. When he's right, he's right. Hey, command wants us to look around, we look around. I don't know. Sounds like a waste of three stone cold, ruggedly handsome Delta operators such as ourselves. Think of it as a paid vacation. Well, for future reference, I prefer my beaches with a three-to-one sexy lady dead body ratio. Logo, do you ever actually hear the shit coming out of your mouth? No, I do not, sir. I... Aww. It does feel like we're being watched. We Luke. Someone should see how sexy I look at the job. Lugo's line there was, uh, like it breaks my immersion. Yep, this is what we're looking for. What's that supposed to be? It's a distress beacon, but it ain't military. Someone built this out of spare parts. Any idea who? No, not a fucking clue. Huge talky talky game. I might not talk much, because this is a huge talky. Ooh. That's right, the intelligence. Boop. Walker. My name is John Conrad, the commander of the 33rd Battalion, husband of Elizabeth, and father of Jeremy. If you are reading this, the desertion of the 33rd is undoubtedly no longer a secret. I have failed my mission. Worse, I have failed my men. If any of them be found alive, let it be known that they are innocent. As their commander, 
I forced them under extreme duress to stay in Dubai. To disregard their orders, I alone am to blame. Hmm. You better come see.